Access to the bunker is 24 7 by 365. However, unlike traditional data centres, all visitors are picked up by our own security cleared personnel. The security cleared personnel tend to be ex-police or MOD, so they're well trained in any eventuality. The bunker is designed to withstand a 22 kiloton thermonuclear blast. It's made up of 3 metres thick of reinforced concrete, 1.5 metres of fine grade flint and tungsten rods and a rubber buffer strip. The rubber buffer strip is to take out the impact of that blast, it would also protect in the event of an earthquake. The blast doors, such as the one behind me, protects in the event of a bomb going off of any of the main entrances to the bunker and deflects the blast away from the main data floors. The bunker is fed from two completely separate independent feeds on the national grid. Each one of those feeds is backed up by independent generator and a 2N electrical infrastructure. The bunker data centre is hugely over-engineered versus traditional data centres, being located 100 foot underground. All of its data halls are protected with solid steel welded Faraday cages. Having large amounts of power available to us being outside of London means we can house high availability, high density blade systems. Security is at the heart of everything we do. Physical, digital and human. Making the bunker the most secure data centre in the UK.